What is up? What is good and what's cracking good people YouTube land? It's your boy Gates McCoy. I wanted to get back into another episode of Transformers Devastation. Last time I played it, I just picked a random level. I think it was like level three, I believe it was. But I actually wanted to do the beginning of this game. I haven't really had too much time to come back to it since I had beat the game. Besides that one time you seen me do a video. So I most definitely wanted to come back to it. And uh, I'd hit continue. That's not what I wanted to do. I believe I wanted to hit story mode. And overall, I wanted to get back into it since I didn't really get to. As you can see, we got some destructor cons there. You don't get to see them. Or do you? Um, let me see here. Was it? I believe it is. Most definitely story mode. Yeah, there we go. If that way I can pick the chapter. Just cause we start from the beginning of the chapter. Race, yes. Um. Yeah, I'd rather be able to choose my own character. I don't want to have to be uh, stuck with playing them as they want me to. As you guys see, we have Wheeljack. Rimlock. I am Optimus Prime. Of the Autobots. What are we, waiting for? <laughs> we got Bumblebee. Well, I can't do his. I mean, I'm gonna have to have a transistor radio next to me to do that. All right. And we got Sideswipe. My services and back to Wheeljack. I mean, me. look, it's not that big of a lineup as you've seen the switching, ready? but all the lineup right. is what elite. It's on point. Um, all my stuff's already set. You have weapons, tech, status. Um, this just allows you to uh, modify your weapons and. Uh, and attributes and stats to them, but we don't need to worry about that. And let's get into it. This is the beginning of Transformers Devastation for the PlayStation 4. Let's do it with your boy Gates McCoy. Let's get it. Subscribe, like, that's what's about. Love you guys, it's appreciated. I'm always in a good mood, even though I take things serious and I might not sound like I'm in a good mood. Nine times out of ten, I'm in a good mood. I just usually sound pretty serious. Serious kind of dude. Once again, I enjoy talking with you guys in the comments. Enjoy this. My little girl loves this game. My youngest, I got two girls, but my youngest it's little girl, she just off. loves this. I have the original so toy of Soundwave good. sitting right here to the right of me Seems with Ravage in his tape deck. You guys that know, no Gates McCoy is a toy collector. I love cosplay too. I like to design and make my own outfits and uh, costumes. Then stand back, um, screen, and I got and quite the toy collection, probably, you know, 200 toys or something like that. Various different types from Thundercats, G.I. Joes, Transformers. Constructor cons. Use the kinetic shields to build me a perimeter. I like how they took the styling from the 80s on Gotta appreciate that. given a gift beneath the surface. And I intend to use it. Oh, let's see if I can't get that mic a little bit closer for you guys. That way I maybe might not sound like I'm so damn far away. Megatron and his Decepticons are already here. Hmm. Like the beginning, kind of like a little, uh, uh, I guess we'll consider a mini cartoon, shall we say. On the plus side, I think we finally get to bust some December chops. The humans are evacuated and our mission is clear. Save the city and stop Megatron. Think about this, I didn't even have to pay anything for this awesome game. It was free, offered to me on the PlayStation oh, Network. Lots. I am all right. I don't think it gets any better than that. And out of all the Transformers games, if you guys don't know, you haven't played the newer ones, this one is the best. There's just not a doubt about it. What in the world is all of this? Wheeljack? 
So Come what in. in the world is all is of this? this? Cybertronian technology? I think so. You feel me a bit starved. One of Gates McCoy has got that deep voice. More to the situation than meets Just the been eye. doing voiceovers on the weekend, son. Oh, I not get it. This is the first little battle scene or area or scenario, however you wish to word it or look at it. And this is just going to be a hack and slash. We're just going to uh, kind of beat these, game, these guys down. Uh, this is more of a tutorial of your weapons and skill set, swords. Um, they kind of want you to do a series of actions, but we don't really need to pay any attention to that. Because my boy Gates McCoy already knows what's up. Yep, we're just going to skip through all this. If you guys don't know, now you know. If you guys decide to ever go and get it, you're more than welcome to uh, take your time, figure things out. As you see, Gates McCoy is on point. All right, know what's up. As obviously, I play this with my little girl, and she's constantly having me beat the bad guys. She likes to drive around and do a lot of the other stuff, but she doesn't ever want to beat these guys up. So for that. I have a rhythm to the madness already. Gotta use ranged weapons. Keep firing. They'll fall eventually. I think. On point. Yeah, I know you guys see me fail at a lot of the videos I do because of the learning curve and my stubbornness to review the videos, but that doesn't mean I fail at everything. I feel like I'm a decent player. Kind of collect everything that needs to be collected. I believe you can pick up cars. Kind of beat the crap out of somebody with it. All that stuff. Uh, I cannot pick up a semi, maybe? Nah, can't pick up a semi. That's cool, though. It's irrelevant. Come up here. Grab this. If you guys didn't notice it, well, now you know where it's at. Plain sight, but out of sight. However, you wish to look at it. These trigger little one off special things here. You want to take advantage of the time limit to grab it. Awesome items overall uh, inventory, weapon upgrades, all that kind of stuff like that. This game does have a simple double jump feature. Mechanics are nice. The ability to turn from car uh, to robot are definitely smooth or transitioning from sword to weapon. Obviously, you see it takes no effort. Bumblebee, there's something here. Follow me. What you got? Bleep, blurp, blurp. Uh, yeah, if you guys try to walk through that, you're never going to be able to do it. Uh, if you see these little yellow spots here, you're just going to simply hit the X button to jump, and then hold on to R1, slam into the ground, and it has been done. Get the you get the W. Wow, wow. Bumblebee, what are you doing? Have you been drinking? Remember Blur? He was a uh, how did Blur sound? He was like a... At least that's how it sounded like to me, but then again, I was a kid. A silly kid at that. Oh. I'm just kind of doing some of my uh, uploads as I'm s sitting here doing this. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Don't forget to mash that subscribe and like button. Throw a comment in. I love chatting it up and meeting new people. I love to mention that in my videos, uh, either in the beginning or throughout the video. It's uh, my way of showing gratitude and thanks and uh, celebrating new friendships. I'm all about that. Yeah, I kind of started concentrating there for a minute. Uh, these are just a series of actions that you're going to have to do. Um, what you just seen me do is not necessarily that easy. I'm just kind of used to doing this as I do play this with my little girl. 
I'm kind of used to the little patterns and routines here and where everybody is. So I'll take the guessing away for you guys. And this next scenario coming up, I am going to cut it because it should be the end of level one. Uh, once I kind of walk into this clearing right here that you see ahead of me, I won't ruin it for you. Um, but what, what I do want to do is uh, try to grab everything that I can grab um, that is uh, of importance right now at this particular time. What's the problem here? Oh. Was it not this? I thought I had to, uh... Hmm, maybe it's not this particular spot. I thought there was something I can grab up top. Oh, see, they only allow you to kind of jump so high up there. Oh, but I think that's good enough. Um, you guys are going to like this next scenario for you true hardcore Transformer fans. This next scenario is pretty cool. I don't know about this bumblebee. I wouldn't. I don't even know what kind of car you'd even consider this. Why not just make it a Volkswagen or be cheap about it and make it a 1979 Camaro? I mean, come on, dude. Just get Bumblebee right. Even though that they did have a version of this Bumblebee, actually, I think. Uh, I remember having a toy of it where you put the penny in the back and it would kind of do wheelies and stuff. And you guys have to be old like me to really know what I'm talking about. Check this out. This is pretty dope. Cool, awesome, however you wish to word it. <laughs> My man himself. Devastated. Devastated. Awesome. At least they stay true to his design anyways. How cool is that? Uh, my first time fighting this guy, obviously there's a learning curve because you still don't know the mechanics of the buttons. But uh, me on the other hand, I kind of already know what time it is. He has a uh, health meter over here to the right. And I know that uh, if I stay on him, since he's only the first little mini sub-boss of the beginning of the game, that I'll have no problems taking his ass out. And we're just going to kind of let him have it. Get off me with that. And there you go. That's pretty much a speed run on his ass. Done in about 30 seconds. You're needed elsewhere. The others can finish the other Thanks for watching my videos. Don't forget to mash that like button. You guys are awesome. Just like most YouTubers, it's always appreciated. Those that are respectful. Um, yeah, I gotta come over here. I'm not exactly sure where this ends. I can't really remember offhand, but I do enjoy it. Uh, let me see here. I'm just kind of flying around. And I'm driving around like a maniac. Did I miss something? Boy, he is hauling ass. What's this here? Oh, right here. Nice. Oh, let's not do that. Dude, what is wrong with you? Oh, and Gates McCoy gets it. Yeah, I'm not sure what, what was going on there. That's kind of strange. Grab any little tidbits of, uh, I don't know anything. What the hell is this thing? Can I see this? Since I could pick it up. What the hell is this? New stage art for the gallery. Interesting. I don't think I've ever noticed a bouncing fireball like that. That's kind of cool. Uh, I thought I'd just pick this up. Oh, I gotta manually pick it up. Okay, I get it. Gates of coin might be a little bit slow. Forgive me. Oh, that'd be cool if I could have ripped that out the ground. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So everybody calm down with the laser beams. Yeah, these big robotic arms, they're gnarly. They'll kind of chew you up if you stand under them. You'd be wise not to, they're not vitamins. And if you gates before, you're kind of laying into them. And won't let them get the better of you. I hope you guys are enjoying the video. I enjoy you guys hanging out watching. Most definitely and always. Yeah, see, I won't be able to come this way. I gotta kind of shut that down. See if 
I can bypass these guys. There we go. Gates McCoy's on fire. Oh, Megatron himself. He doesn't want this. I mean, come on. What is the meaning of this? Optimus, come to save the day, I presume? I am here to stop you from destroying the city. Stop me? <laughs> Overall, this game just looks dope. It's, uh, I believe this is what they call you shell shading. No it does really actually add that, do that cartoon feel to it. This is our day on Sesame our Street. Patron. The word of the day is dope. Meaning no, awesome or cool. I am no interested <laughs> destroying that. But I'm not opposed to I hope you guys enjoyed my uh, 100th video upload special that I had did there. <laughs> I definitely appreciate all you guys that tuned in and gave that feedback and everything else. That's awesome. And uh, when he's got the shield, you gotta kind of drive at him. And uh, move into the attack with the sword. And we're just kind of burn him down for the most part. I'm gonna slide around. I'm gonna give him the business. Transfer into a car. Smashing the shield. I should have mashed that R1 when I had the opportunity. And that's Kurt. Speed run on uh, Megatron as well. Cybertron's name. <laughs> Autobots, Megatron is headed for that steel tower. Move out. Hmm. Uh, these doors will be the same thing as Megatron's shield. You're pretty much going to get a little bit of a running start. Megatron. And you're going to kind of come at it with a sword. And that'll be it. No need to guess. Hopefully everybody's enjoying their weekend. I know I have, most definitely. Got to hang out with the missus. Yeah, I'll be a little bit cheap about it. Ah, uh, these bubble domes are the same thing. Anytime you see a purple shield of any sort, it's going to be a charging attack into the square or triangle. Uh, this right here will allow you to switch your character, uh, more or less go into the base where you seen me start originally. But there's no point in that. Yeah, it's going to be pretty much a rinse and repeat. No, we don't. We just gotta use enough. Maybe you gotta use all your abilities. But me, I'm just gonna make it do what it do. Yeah. Uh, what that was pretty much trying to tell you, since I kind of skipped past it so fast, is that when you press in the L3 and the R3 buttons, it will activate a uh, special attack when you actually have it available. Um, that might be what the yellow gauge is, I'm not 100% sure. I'm not quite paying attention. The orange dot on your map marks your destination. Reach it to complete your mission. Well, there you go. You have it, ladies and gentlemen. Hear what the gentleman said. Uh, I will collect whatever I got to. I see a little another jumping orange thing here. This is what I meant by like a jumping fireball. I don't remember these. I'm trying to figure out how to how to pick them up. Kind of spamming the uh, circle button in hopes that I'll be able to grab it. Got him way up in midair. Nice, that'll work. Obviously, we know we gotta go that way. Um, this will take me down. We don't need all that. Let's just kind of finish this up. Finish up what we started. 
Oh, as he transforms right through it all, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, wrong way. I gotta come this way. Give these guys a piece of my mind. He's just too fast. He's got, you know, we all know he's the ninja of the group. Let's be honest here. I loved uh, Bumblebee in the uh, Transformers movies for sure. Oh, let's not pass anything up. There we go. Try to play catch up if we can. Transforming right back into it. Look at these guys. They don't know what they're asking for. Psych. I don't think so, son. Yeah, Bumblebee's kind of out cold. Man, come on. I am on fire. Precision shooting, timing, hack and slash. I mean, I'm making good headway. I mean, come on, dude. There's the tower. I'm going to pat myself on the back a little bit here. Probably one of the best uh, runs I had at the intro of this game. Considering the fact that I've only kind of went through it once and then uh, dabbled in this first level with my little girl here and there. She doesn't usually make it this far before she gets up. Obviously, she's a little too young, the learning curve still a little bit much, but she is uh, good enough to play it. Maybe I'll have a future uh, gamer on my hands here. Oh, really? Oh, fuck. I didn't even know I was a robot, to be honest with you. I mean, a, a car. Oh, look at this guy. This has got jokes. That's right. We can't have that. I can't come down here and break this. Kind of slide through the gap. Oh, and he gets, the, he gets it done. All right, we're just going to keep going. I'll so you guys can see why I like Bumblebee. Overall, better moves. A little bit more agile. Um, I believe this will be the ending of the first level. This will be the culmination of the boss fight. Um, if I'm not mistaken, it is uh, Megatron that we will be fighting, I do believe. Don't forget to subscribe, mash that like button. That's always appreciated. Oh, I gotta chase him down, is it? Don't let him escape. Already yeah, so you can tell that I haven't right, quite come to the end of the yeah, first board too often. Obviously, I'm familiar with it by the way I'm approaching it and getting the job done. I could have been firing actually, I don't know what else I think. Yeah. Now I'm making things a little bit more complicated than they gotta be. <laughs> We're not bullets, but that's alright. I do believe, if memory serves me correct, that these guys will ultimately end up reaching a destination. Yeah, when you hit those little 
uh, circle things, those are speed boosts that do allow you to kind of blast through those gates. Allowing gates to blast through the gates. I believe this is the boss fight that I was referring to with Megatron. I believe this is uh, a culmination to the end of the first level, if I'm not mistaken. And it's uh, pretty easy. You just gotta kinda come over here and hit these circles. And then break his shield. And just kinda burn him down. I'll turn into a tank. He didn't like that. If we can't set these grenades out on him. That might not have did any damage due to the fact that he threw his shield up. I didn't know that I was gonna be timing that perfectly. Yeah, you can hear me mashing those buttons in my games. That's how you know I'm a real gamer. Get off with that shit. I can't come around him like this. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, he doesn't like that very much. That's cool. I don't like him very much. And that would be the W. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, I would have given myself a little bit better of a C ranking. Come on now. My destiny awaits below. As for you, I just engaged the security system. Good luck getting in, Prime. <laughs> Teltran 1, analyze. It's a ship of unknown origins, buried beneath the city. How do I shut down the security system? It appears there is a dual-layer security protocol in place. You'll first need to disable three sub-generators. Once huh. disabled, the primary generator will be vulnerable. Autobots, transform and roll out. And uh, I'm going to cut the segment here. Next time you see me guys do a, uh, was this part two? Next time you see me do a part three on this video, I'll uh, try to start it right here in the same spot or from level two, uh, which I do believe is kind of the same spot. I'm not 100% sure if it stops me or, or whatnot. Anyways, Gates McCoy, love having you. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like, throw comments in there. Let's chat it up. Let's hang out. Always appreciated. Gates McCoy out. Later, people.